हेलो स्टूडेंट टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट विद द नेक्स्ट लेसन दैट इज द फिश बास्केट एक्सेप्टिंग एंड अडेप्टिंग टू चेंज इट इज सेड द चेंज इज द लॉ ऑफ नेचर फ्रॉम अ यंग किड यू ग्रो इन टू अ टीन एजर देन इन टू अडोलसेंट एंड फाइनली इन टू एन अडल्ट एज यू ग्रो यू विल एक्सपीरियंस वेरियस चेंजेस इन योर फिजिकल अपियरेंस योर एनवायरमेंट एंड योर लाइफ स्टाइल there will be instances when you have to step out of your comfort zone and face new challenges those who do not adapt to change lead a stagnant life with little progress so this is this story is all about the change we we grow up there is a change in our in our bodies we in a there is a change in our thinking process and uh, you know every time things changes and if we keep on you know we if we'll be in our comfort zone all the time then there will be a little progress so let's start with the story once upon a time a fisher woman visited her brother who was a gardener in the nearby village due to the recent storm at the sea her fishing business was not doing well and she was thinking of taking up the business of gardening and selling flowers like her brother She came to her brother's house in the evening with an empty fish basket after selling of the fish in the market. So there was a fisher woman and once uh, she visited her brother and he was a gardener in a nearby village. And because of the recent storm in the sea, you know the busy, the fishing business was not going so well. And what she was thinking she was thinking that she would also take the business of gardening and selling flowers like her brother. so once she visited to her brother's house uh, with an empty fish basket after selling all the fish the gardener's wife offered her a good meal and asked her to take rest while the gardener returned from the market as it was a gardener's house some basket of beautiful fragrant flowers were kept in the room where the fisher woman was asked to rest so in the room where uh, gardener's wife asked her to rest uh, it was you know there were many many beautiful flowers kept The fisher woman lay on the bed, but because of the fragrance of the flower, she couldn't sleep. She was restless and began to fidget it. But she was not uh, happy with those smell of the flowers. She, she was feeling, you know, very restless. The gardener's wife, who was sitting uh, in the porch, saw her condition and asked, "Why you are tossing from side to side so restlessly?" So when the gardener's wife saw that she was restless and she is not comfortable there, then she asked, "That why you are?" so comfortable and you are turning from uh, from one side to on the other side on the bed what what's the problem the fisherman replied i don't know dear perhaps the smell of flowers has been disturbing my sleep can you please give me my basket that will surely put me to sleep the basket was brought to her she sprinkled water on it and sat set it near her nose then she fa- sound asleep snored all night next morning she headed towards a village and dropped the idea of gar- gar- gardening because she sh- thought she was so accustomed to the smell of fish that she could not adjust to the fragrance fragrance of flowers so now she realized that she is so used to the smell of fish that she cannot you know uh, do gardening or can cannot sell flowers because she is very used to uh, she is very used to of the smell of uh, fish but not of flowers that is what happens with most of us when we face a change in life we resist change because we have settled into a comfort zone based on our habits and experiences we are happy and comfortable doing what we have been doing and fear any change so this also we do that because of the fear of change most of the time we are just happy and comfortable whatever we are doing we don't want to come out from the comfort zone just like this fisher woman now reflections Life is made up of many seasons of change. Change is one of the most cons- consistent things that happens in our lives. Most of the time we are not fully prepared to face the changes that take place in our life, but we should keep positive and open attitude to accepting and adapting to changes. Change requires us to move out from of our comfort zone. Most of the time the changes we face in life are for our good and we should happily accept them. So we should not uh, you know fear of change. we should always accept the change and we should face the changes and we should always try to come out uh, of our comfort zone if we will do so then only we will be able to progress i hope this story is clear to you all i will be sending the question answers of this lesson in a pdf form either in the group 
or in the uh, google classroom uh, you will be informed soon thank you so much class